Document control is critical to the entire engineering and design lifecycle. ADEPT provides single and multi-site companies with secure controlled access to documents from any connected location. In this short video, you'll learn how ADEPT will help you manage and control enterprise documents, secure and protect your intellectual property, ensure everyone finds the latest version of any document, provide enterprise visibility to document status, manage complex interrelationships between documents, and limit distribution of uncontrolled documents. Let's look at how easy it is to get your documents under control with ADEPT. First, you select the documents you want to bring into ADEPT. You browse out to your Windows folder structure, then specify whether or not you want ADEPT to manage new versions, whether or not you want it to use the full text search, as well as several other options. Before ADEPT scans the folder, let's check and see if there's any subfolders. Now that we see the subfolders, we can tell ADEPT to synchronize both the parent and subfolders. When you synchronize, ADEPT extracts attributes and properties from the document, understands all the file relationships that may exist with AutoCAD X references or SolidWorks or Inventor assemblies, and will extract thumbnails as well. Once synchronization is complete, you'll see a list of all the files that were brought into ADEPT as well as the information extracted from each document. Now that the documents are in ADEPT, the next step for the administrator is to assign rights to the libraries or folders. On the left of the screen, you can see this tree structure of the folders we just brought in. For example, the CAD managers and designers will have the right to check out files to make changes and to participate in workflow. Maintenance, field engineers, shop floor, marketing, contractors, and vendors will have the ability to view and mark up documents and to assign files they mark up for review. And for the document control group, they will have full access to rename and delete files. It's that simple to set up access rights for a group of folders. With all this information in ADEPT, you can type in some key information that was extracted during the synchronization, let's say the project name, and then you'll get a list of results of all the files that pertain to that project. All extracted attribute and property data can be seen on the data card. The file relationships, including where used and composed of information, can be seen in the tree structure and on the where used in children tabs. You can also see the extracted thumbnail images without needing to open the file. Now let's check out a file and make a change to it. Users everywhere can see the, the file status and who is working on the document. When a file is checked out, ADAPT locks the master file safely on the server and places a copy in the user's work area for editing. Other users can view the master but can't sign out for edit while someone else has it. This protects duplicates and accidental overwrites. Once you make the necessary edits, you can check it in and everyone now has access to the latest version, pending any approval workflows you may have in place. For users of 2D and 3D software like AutoCAD, MicroStation, SolidWorks, or Autodesk Inventor, where reference files are heavily used, ADEPT's version control capabilities go even deeper. When files with parent-child relationships are revised, ADEPT keeps all the related fields linked to the correct version of the revised file. You have the flexibility to configure ADEPT so that the parent file always references the latest version of a child, as in this case, in many living design environments, or so that it remains fixed to the original version, which allows you to see the way the design was, for example, when you shipped it. ADEPT maintains these relationships automatically as files are checked in and checked out, routed through workflows, copied, and, and renamed. Without ADEPT, these critical relationships may be broken, resulting in expensive mistakes and time delays. In some CAD environments, it is important to track not only the major versions, but also the minor versions. Minor versions are a series of edits 
that may occur by multiple users prior to the, fi the file's final approval. By tracking minor versions, users have the flexibility of prototyping multiple versions of a design prior to checking one in to replace the original file. Adept also gives you the ability to create relationships between documents of any type. In this example, I've selected a purchase order as my parent, and now I'm, I want to select a specific design and some important email correspondence to relate these together. File relationships allow others to quickly see related files regardless of the location on your global network. Adept email notification alerts users when do a document has been assigned to them for edits or for approval. Rather than emailing the file itself and distributing uncontrolled revisions through email, Adept sends a link to the users that takes them to Adept and to the document or list of documents that requires their attention. This also reduces the number of large 2D and 3D CAD files clogging up your email system. Adept maintains a complete audit trail of each document throughout its life cycle. Authorized users can see the ongoing activity history of a file, including what actions were taken, by whom, and the date and time that the action occurred. This audit trail helps with internal process optimization, internal protection of IP, and streamlines compliance with industry standards and government regulations. Perhaps most important, Adept's vaulting method, the way we secure and protect your files, is unique in that it gives you the security and protection you need without encrypting or scrambling your file names and folders, or importing your documents into a proprietary database. Adept never holds your documents or data hostage. To learn more about Adept's document management capabilities, please visit our resource center at SynergistSoftware.com.